Uh, you have you ever heard the term ho blueser? Like if, if somebody says, why are, why are you bluesing? Blue, there's not, nothing yeah. to do with blushing, right? No, no, well, it's okay. close enough. It's oh, really? when you experience the ups and downs oh. of romance and love, and now you're listening to sad music, happy music. It's something <laughs> that I think we've all done at some stage. We know Adele is like the queen of writing songs about her feelings. And uh, so is singing sensation Karabo Mohan. Of course, we all know and love him very, very much. And of course, his latest album, um, Matters of the Heart, really is testament to that. And we got to sit down to an unplugged session with the man himself. Yes, your broken heart. Singer songwriter Karabo Mukhane first burst onto the music scene back in 2015 after winning a music reality show. The 25 year old from Mpumalanga has done great things since then, giving us hits like Ding Dong and Kakati. Tonight, we have the pleasure of listening in on an unplugged session for his latest album titled Matters of the Heart. Carabo took his audience on a journey of his life through song as his new album explores his triumphs and personal battles over the years. Carabo, it must be exciting to see all of this finally come together. Very exciting, man. Very exciting. I get to launch my album. Matters of the Heart, I'm really excited about it and I'm really grateful, man, just to get the opportunity to do it, yeah. And what inspired the creation of the album? What inspired the album, man, is my love for music and uh, my love for R&B uh, as a genre and, that, and hence I'm doing R&B uh, because it's what I used to listen to mostly when I was growing up and um, yeah, I mean, I decided to myself, you know what, I'm going to write about music, but, I mean, about love. And my music is all about love and I believe that love is the one thing that can bring people together but not only that, but also just keep them together as well, you know? Um, and I think in this country, we need that right now, you know? Love, all the way. While still a teenager, Karabo wrote a few songs as a hobby. He revisited his old music books and some of those early songs are part of this album. Most of the songs I had written prior to getting into studio, it took us about four months. Some songs I wrote uh, in studio. And I think also for me, it, it gives people the idea of where I'm coming from, what it is that I'm trying to relate to them. And um, I believe there's a song for everybody on that album. Now, I know this is a difficult question, but I have to ask it. If you were to choose one song on the album to be your favorite, which one would it be and why? My favorite track on the album is Kakati. Um, one of my favorite songs on the album, because I mean, I wrote the song in Varsity. A very good friend of mine, Hita Mutenda, a Vanda guy. Um, every single time I would greet him, he would say, so I'd be like, hey, Hita, what's up? What's going on? And he'd be like, ah, Kakati Awuna. And from then, from that, I decided to write a song called Adutori Kakat, uh, which simply means I've got no problems as long as I've got you in my life. And that song I wrote for a girl that I had a crush on at the time, um, and I was in varsity. Well, I think it was very original. I think uh, it shows the way forward about Tukarabo. I didn't really, I, I've never seen him perform, to be, to be frank. But after this, I think it has increased my appetite for him in the industry. I'll buy more tickets, I'll go to his shows, I'll buy the albums as well. He's an amazing singer, first of all. Um, and obviously, we've been working with him for a while, and sometimes we sneak up our platform, Nati, you know, we show our. So we enjoy working with him a lot because he's a very great performer. I am a huge Karabo fan. I'm blown away by his, um, by his humility in how he sings and his delivery, his lyrical content, how he writes his songs. He's just so organic and just so pure, so I really enjoyed it. I did. I love the song about, uh, the song that he wrote for his future wife. I felt that it was very intimate. So yeah, we can't wait for him to get married one day and hopefully we'll be there to witness that as well. In the near future, Karabo will be competing on Tropica, Island of Treasure, and he's writing a book. From writing to singing, this young man's talent is shining bright and his star is on the rise.